In the latest volume of Comey Can't Communicate, the couple, Tadano and Comey, are in her bedroom trying to study for school. Right. When Comey uses this opportunity to spend some actual time with Tadano, to which Tadano agrees to. Awkward at first because they're both new at love, Tadano eventually works up the courage to make a move. Comey being Comey, she gets all flustered but it was her idea for them to spend time together, so she consents to his advance. And oh my goodness, who wouldn't fall willingly into that invitation? I mean, come on. But that's not what this video is about. This video is about this guy. Komi and Tadano aren't alone. Way back in Volume 7, their classmates find out Komi's birthday is around Christmas, and they're all trying to figure out what to get her for a present. After several attempts, it's Tadano's time to suggest something. Since he turns out to express a huge amount of empathy toward those around him, he picks up on the fact that Comey is a big fan of kitty cats. So his suggestion is this giant kitty cat body pillow. The other classmates love it and present it to Comey when they all come over to her house. Turns out it was the best gift ever and Tadano is happy that she's happy. Throughout the series, Komi is seen cuddling with it on occasion, keeping the gift relevant in the story. Now, fast forward back to the latest volume of the manga series. Oh my goodness. Komi and Tadano finally hug. Aww. Such an event that it took up a full page of the manga. But remember, this video isn't about that. It's about this guy. Since this is a romantic comedy and the Japanese are famous for their silly depictions of expressions on characters, I thought it was hilarious that he actually put this in the background of this monumental moment. While we the audience are cheering on the couple, we get some extra laughs from the background. Did you happen to notice this going on in the scene when you first read this chapter? Did it actually make you LOL like I did? I myself am a big fan of kitty cats, so this hit on a personal note, and I was very appreciative of the artist's creativity and humor. I'm totally looking forward to the next volumes of the manga.